Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video, we are going to fill in these boxes with appropriate values such that if we add, subtract and multiply, we are supposed to get 12, 20, 8 and 15. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first step. We are going to label these boxes. I'm going to label this one A, this box with B, this with C and this with D. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on these multiplication operations first. We are going to focus on these top boxes first. A times B equals to 12 and here I have copied it down A times B equals to 12. Now let's focus on these boxes B times D equals to 8 and here I have copied it down B times D equals to 8 and now we are going to manipulate these two equations. Let me go ahead divide both sides by A and divide this side by A as well. So that is going to give us this A and A is gone. So we got B equals to 12 divided by A. And in this second equation, I'm going to divide both sides by D on this side and D on this side as well. So that is going to give us this D and D is gone. So we got B equals to 8 divided by D. And now let's go ahead and compare these two equations. As we can see, the left hand sides are same. So therefore we can equate the right hand sides. So therefore we can write 12 divided by A equals to 8 divided by D. Let's go ahead and cross multiply. So we are going to get 12 D equals to 8 times a. Now let's divide both sides by 12. This 12 and 12 is gone. So d turns out to be equal to when we reduce this thing that's going to give us 2a divided by 3. So d turns out to be equal to 2a divided by 3 in this very first step. And here's our next step. Let's focus on these boxes a plus c equals to 15. And here I have copied down A plus C equals to 15. Now let's focus on these boxes C minus D equals to 20. And here I have copied it down C minus D equals to 20. And now we are going to subtract these equations. I'm going to subtract this uh, bottom one from the top. So let's go ahead and change the sign. Positive become negative. Negative become positive and this positive become negative as well and now this c and minus c they are gone so we simply ended up with a plus d equals to negative 5 on the right hand side and now we know from the previous step d equals to 2a divided by 3 so therefore i'm going to replace this d by 2a divided by 3 so our equation is going to be written as a plus 2a divided by 3 equals to negative 5. And now let's focus on this left hand side of this equation. And here I have copied it down. And here a could be written as 3a divided by 3 to make sure we have the same denominators. So our simplified answer turns out to be a 5a divided by 3. So therefore I'm going to replace this part by this 5a divided by 3. So we can write this thing 5a divided by 3 equals to negative 5. Now we want to isolate a so I'm going to multiply by the reciprocal so that is going to be 3 fifth on this side and likewise I'm going to multiply 3 fifth on this side as well and here we can see this 5 and 5 is gone 3 and 3 is gone so we got a equals to here this 5 and 5 is gone so a turns out to be 
negative 3. So therefore our this box A turns out to be negative 3. And now let's focus on these boxes A times B equals to 12 and we know that A value is negative 3. So therefore B value has got to be negative 4 because if we multiply negative 3 and negative 4 we indeed get positive 12. And now let's focus on these boxes A plus C equals to 15 and we know our A value is negative 3. So therefore this C box has got to be positive 18 such that if we add these numbers we indeed get positive 15. And now let's focus on these boxes B times D equals to positive 8 and we know our B value is negative 4. So therefore D box has got to be negative 2 because if we multiply these two numbers we indeed get this positive 8. And finally if we look at these boxes C minus D equals to 20 and if we simplify this thing we indeed get uh, positive 20 as well. So thus our final answer turns out to be A equals to negative 3, B equals to negative 4, C turns out to be 18 and D negative 2. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.